tank uh, early on because you'll typically go, you know, 4 one, one sometimes you'll go 2 one, 2 Still a reasonably squishy. Do you prefer a much more pointed strategy like Draw Ranger kind of strategies where there is one really key ending point essentially for uh, and if you fail that, then game might be over. A lot of it, I think, just comes down to the quality of the teams and if they can pull off that timing. Um, and, you know, like te teams like Wings and stuff, they can do any strategy they want because they're execution. They went them in game, though. Yeah, because like, I quit out of Dota and dropped back in and it's, it didn't change anything, so I don't know. All right, for a second there, I thought it might have been me, but. If it gets real bad, we'll, we'll try another reconnect, but <laughs> for right now, guys. Just uh, role play like these two European teams are playing on Perfect World servers. Pile I die, tether away over to Puppy is going to be able to make the escape away from Vanscore, but can he get away from Cedoy? No, he absolutely cannot. The spin's going to go down. Puppy will invis himself away, but it looks like the Voodoo Restoration will keep the rest of Flipside alive against MPs. Uh, in base, and then getting the boots as soon as possible. So keeping out of, out of range of the spin and keeping him alive. He may have actually gone down if uh, MP was able to get in range of the spin. MP? Will be able to get on top of Roger. It looks like they're okay with Chen dying. If they could just get a kill in return on Pylai Die. The last couple right clicks, a little bit more, and they've got him. One for one trade off there. A bit advantage of the hard creep camp that is available. Mid lane CS seems it could be going uh, all right. Whoa, 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 whoa. Looks like got a juggernaut. How did they get a juggernaut? Name a haste. So he can make a, a quick jump over to that bottom lane and flip sign stick around. Normally these aggro try lanes. Oh, hold on, MP. Sounds up a little bit, paralyzing cast, they get some damage out, MP's gonna turn, trying to go on Vanscore with the help of Ferev, who's got the Ravage ready to go. They can easily get this kill, but maybe MP's gonna die first, if he's not enough. Ferev now drops the Ravage, Witch Doctor's still alive, but in the back line, looks like they close the distance with the Drone Ranger, easily execute him, one, two, and leave the Vanscore. Witch Doctor stuck in the trees for last, and make it a three. Rush, really nice rotation from him as well. Just uh, setting them up, getting the three kills, getting them back into the game. Ready to get killed with Dragonite as well. Maybe able to get this. Yeah, they just stay grouped up together, make the rotation across, and this is big. Uh, I mean, that rotation bottom lane obviously really offsets all the damage that flip ball as he is. Whenever you die like that early on, it's gonna slow down his treads, it's gonna slow down whatever item he goes for after. Maybe a dragon, it's maybe a shadow blade, but. Oh, look at that damage. He said, Brev. He's gonna go for the early level the earlier, but... Oh, they are gonna TP. It's a bit too late for the tier 1 tower, and a bit too late to get the proper kind of initiation. MP is just gonna go on a van score with the spin, but again, the Buddha Restoration makes the difference here. Tame My Wild, though, is still in trouble. He's gushed up on the slash, brought down. Flipside will lose one of their fours. Gino, he tp to the lane, so he has no free TP out. Uh, I think he's about to die. Cedo, I definitely not expecting this one. They're even going to TP the Marana in just as the extra bit of help. Clearly not needed, though. Their Drill Ranger is Bloodstone, but Timber went up first. Uh, there's a lot of heroes that have kill potential on him, unless he's ahead or loose in a position where he's very tanky. Oh. Too well. Arrow. Ail fan for but the Buddha Restoration is still enough to keep him alive against this spin. And now the Talos on mid one, they're going to be able to bring him down. A very important kill. The wraparound time though, and the flip side, they know positioning is going to be pretty key here if they want to keep up this push. MP forced out to spin as a paralyzing pass makes his way towards him. Red's going to be on the front lines here, slowing down Van's core. Knowing that Flipside really really can't contest him because he's got the Ravage ready to go. If they turn on Perev, they're easily going to be able to get that kill. They actually came in from the behind, though. They do manage to nail Roger, though, with an arrow. Bring him down. Puppy's going to be the trade-off, though. One for two so far. Flipside Tactics fighting it out with the force. The Ravage is ready to go, though. And a land onto two. They're going to focus down Team My Wild first. He turns for Pylai Dai, getting the stun. The Drone Ranger will pick up the kill, but the Timbersaw quick to fall. Cedoy now has to make an escape away from three secret heroes. That's just not going to happen. And Secret win the fight, keep their offlane tower alive, and Secret will take the safe. All air from flip side has led to so much more. Secret now have a mech. They're gonna try and relocate in into the river here and fight this one out. MP just spins forward straight into the enemy team. Red helping lead the way, but a little bit of a mech. They've got the stun though on the Juggernaut. They managed to bring him down. 
Nobody down from Flipside. They all looking healthy. Pups, Puppy's gonna get caught, looks like. Oh, no, he actually managed to get away to the side. A little bit of chop from the Chakram as well as the last from the Seder. Neither one catches. Puppy no staying one step ahead of Shotchlow. That should have been two down for sure, but Flipside Tactics wouldn't quite nail him. They will be able to get this tier one off lane tower. Brett being slowed out. Maybe Secret's turn to make the mistake. Thinking that they could fight that one. Brett's going to lose his life as he's inevitably slowed down and right clicked apart. Arrow nail one. They don't have the tide hunter just yet. So Shotslow is going to be the target here. Has his timber chain up in one more second. They've already TP'd one here off. That's the draw ranger gone from this fight. So this is free reign for Secret to get as many picks. Nice bounce there from the shuriken. He's going to be able to stop a couple of TP's. Roger goes down as well as Van scores with. Witch Doctor, that's going to be two track kills for Secret. Again, a small error from Flipside leads goal to the Secret team. Right, going into the bottom of Cyber Axe, yes. Even though Titus Ravage is a little bit risky, but he has more time. Bodyguard Tater, oh, but a rabbit nails four, three groups up, and they just wipe through almost all of them. Team by Wild will be able to take most of it, though, with a haste drone. He managed to get away, MP is the target, but the Invis is actually helping him out. Moonlight Shadow manages to help MP dodge enough damage to stay alive. Shotslow, last one left for Flipside inside the fight. He'll go down at a three. Oh, Pylod Dye is going to be the target here, does have a tether, but doesn't actually get enough distance to zip away. They will manage to nail him with a paralyzing cast. Moonlight Shadow buys him some time. Going to set up some sort of rescue mission here, maybe, for the Wisp. Dread's going to be able to come in. He's got the Blink Dagger ready to go. Waiting out for the Ravage. Looks like he got stunned by Tame by Wild and won't be able to get off a Ravage right away. In fact, he's silenced now by Seedoy. Evolving is a bit lacking on their corner. They could still lose this fight against Berev with his Blink Dagger Ravage ready to go. Snatches the haste rune away from Tame My Wild. Berev's got mobility for days now. Chakram comes out and does a good amount of damage. Silence misses though. And now Berev, it looks like he sees the drop. He's going to run straight into all of these heroes. Hits the four man. Verana right there on the side. Goes straight for Cedoy, but the heals come through. The sustain from flip side wins out. And now it looks like Secret is forced to back away until MP comes in. Timbersaw overextends himself. He goes down. Roger looks for the kill on MP, can't quite get it. MP makes his way around the trees. Tame my wild. Meanwhile, he's double to the ultimate. Now run out is going to be an ineffective core for this fight. Tries to TP away, barely makes it away. Cedar caught by MP is brought low to be able to hit him. Oh, relocate actually gonna come straight onto the Dragonite, but he's got the blink, so he will stay ahead of this. Attempted to jump here from Secret. They spin right in though. Brev, he may not have the Ravage, but he's right in Cedoy's face. Does manage to get that kill with the help of MP Dance Core. Lays out the Death Ward. They go for the Wisp, but he gets relocated out of the fight just in time. Roger, meanwhile, he's dead, and so is this Creek Army. Mid one makes short work of that one. Shasho zips on through, but straight to four heroes, and he doesn't have any backup. He's just a goner. Three already gone from flip side as they attempt to get no hurricane fight just the dragon line, so if they do get on top of her, flip side with no real way to save it before staff something like that. So if she gets got on, she is she's going down. Side tactics not going to give up just yet. Looks like they're going to try and catch mid one here. Banscore was hiding in the trees, but he doesn't actually manage to get a paralyzing cast out. Mid one hit himself away, but won't be able to make the blink out. Shotshow's here. Does manage to get some damage out onto mid one. He's just getting distance for a blink dagger. Not able to do it just yet. Two more seconds. Chakram juked away. Mid one almost makes it out, but no. He loses that Aegis. Can they get him a second time? Cedoy ready to go. The uh, leap. Blink out, TP, and mid one. Looks like he's good. Highlight eye. He came in, thought he needed to help the Murata, but actually just is going to give Flipside a free kill. In the meantime, they did manage to get the Dragonite. Here comes Rev. He killed the Dragonite. He's here for even more. He's got Flipside down with three. And Shotra with the TP out. Manta is barely makes it away from the physical damage, but still on his way for the foreseeable future. Yeah, the bounty with a Crimson Guard now is also massively mitigating the Drow's damage. Arrow nails him, and all the sustain in the world from that Voodoo Restoration won't be able to get him that kill. They'll get a little bit more to Roger, yet another track kill. Going to Team Secret as they... Yeah, they're gonna have to deal with some massive wave spit now, so... Gonna be able to flip a whole lot of the heroes, just continue to help them chase them down with the track. Flipside struggling to stop the bleeding here. They're going to try and come in with Tame My Wild to make the jump, but with Marana making her entrance straight into the draw range of Purser down with magic damage. And 
now they're even pursuing into the tier 3 tower. MP, he's got the Omni Slash ready to go, and he sees those track kills available for him. Witch Doctor turns around, trying to throw up a Death Ward, but it's his death that comes apart, as that ward does very little as the Omni Slash brings him down. Shot slow, deep past the tier 4 towers. Team Secret will claim him too. Team by Wild can't even make it back to the base. He's going to be caught by the guts. Attempts to armla toggle, but no such luck. Team Secret, white flip side inside their own base at 27 minutes, and force flip side into an early GG. Yeah, their they had their lineup was it was able to win this game. It was smart. They had to execute well and play very very cleanly. But a couple mistakes early on, that tri lane giving up the death, Drow dying a couple times, dragging.